The next technique is called thoracic thrust screw technique. So what we do in that technique is we place again the spinous processes of the thoracic vertebra in this crease between the thinner and hypothenar eminence. So we place one hand directly onto the spinous processes. We place the other hand on top of it. The patient takes a deep breath and as they're breathing out, you take up the slack and at the very end, you deliver an impulse. Now, uh, variations of this technique can induce a little bit of rotation. In other words, as you are taking up the slack, you can rotate clockwise or counterclockwise, uh, uh, creating a little bit of rotation and side bending in your thrust manipulation. So in that case, if I would rotate clockwise, I would have the patient take a deep breath, and then when they would breathe out, I would slowly rotate and then deliver the impulse.